Hello, welcome back to Let's Play Little King's Story. My name is Leonardo, and let's keep going. So last time we heard about a Hauser's plan to build a town square, and we're gonna do that now. So sit on the throne, get with the um, kingdom plan, and here's a town square. Let's build it. We have like 661,000 left, which is not a lot, but we'll get on uh, recovering what we spent later. Anyway, we have a town square now, which is basically a suggestion box, and the suggestion box brings us quests and rumors, and our first semi-boss fight, so that's a pretty cool, I mean, a pretty cool, uh, pretty cool, not pretty cool, a pretty cool thing to get money and other things like treasures and weaponry and all that, so let's get some rest. And there's a suggestion box. A little soldier comes up to it and puts a letter inside. Which is good, that's what it's for. And our king wakes up the next morning. Come on. We get out of the room and Hauser says Good morning, my king. Good morning, Hauser. Yay, the suggestion box is full. Wow, that was fast. I can fill it in my crown. Okay, yeah, I'll do that. Anyway, so to check the citizen's suggestions, you, uh, you sit on the throne, go to Hauser, and suggestion box. Now, we have three letters inside, which is not really full, but whatever. Uh, we have test mail from Hauser. It says, The suggestion box will be filled every morning with fan letters from, or complaints from the citizens. As king, you must solve the citizens' problems. We have, Please redecorate. Yoo-hoo! This is Verde. I like the suggestion box. Oh, uh, put us some paintings. We'll do that after we find some paintings. And our first rumor, which is kind of like a small boss fight. I'll show you when we get there. Okay, it says, I was walking alone and I heard something from the deserted graveyard. I was all weirded out, but I, I checked it out anyway. Only to find a cow with a skull for a head. And you press A and it says, accept this quest? Yes. And that is our first rumor, which is... Oh my, could that be the legendary cowboys of the cemetery? That legend has been around in this kingdom for quite a while. So yeah, it's a cow with a skull head. And that uh, when you defeat an, uh... Okay, these are called guardians. When you defeat a guardian, all the enemies in that area disappear. You can build something there, like new villages, new residences, and all that. In this case, it uh, it's pr it provides us with space to build a church. So let's go do that. We need mainly uh, soldiers. Let's find the soldiers. Here's one. Here's another one until the tower. Come down. Calm down. Come down. Okay. Here he comes. Wait, no. Come down. What? You're... You're stuck there. Okay, whatever. I'm gonna... Start all over again. So here's one, two, three... Oh! He came down that way. That's okay. Four. We're missing a soldier. Let's find him. Maybe he's over here. New! Here's a suggestion box, and uh, where's my soldier? Should be around here. I can't find him. Maybe he's inside the guard house. Let's see. No, no one there. Uh, maybe here. Nope. Where'd he go? No, not here. Not here. Oh boy. Wait, do I only have like four soldiers? I remember having five of them. Maybe he's back at the castle. I don't know. Let's look around. Maybe in the back? I can't find him. Ah, uh, we'll make another one. We have like two carefree adults wandering around after all, so we have extra people. Here you are. Mike! Let's do it. Ah, uh, now let's see. There we go. Go inside and... Became a grunt soldier. Okay, we can now take on the mini boss and get this guy down with in the process. And that is Cargo too. There we go, and um, we get a turnip and we get a gold. <laughs> I mean, we get gold coins. Anyway, 
past this point, you see the little um, yellow and uh, black thing here? Once you pass that, here is the boss area I'm gonna show you. Everything turns purple for some reason, and there's a mini boss, the Guardian. It's the cow skull thing, so. Fight! This is our first uh, mini boss thing, and this guy has a pattern. He does that, he becomes unconscious, and then he comes back to battle like that. You have to be fast for this battle. Don't be slow and let him hit you. When he does that, stay away from him. And he does that, you can attack him again. And uh, call him back, let him crash, and attack again. It's a really simple pattern, but then again, it's the first boss, so nothing unexpected from that. Anyway, stay away from the jump. And if you uh, if you start getting like many people killed or something, you can always like run away from battle, like run away, and uh, you can well run away. I don't know how to explain that. Anyway, ha! <laughs> Whoops! Come on! Come on! Come on! Oh, and he does this. It's kind of annoying because the thing goes all the way through the arena. You can do this while it does that, which is basically killing him again. Hopefully we won't lose anyone over this battle. It's pretty easy. That should do it, I think. Or maybe, like, a little bit of... Yeah. He has, like, one hit left, and that's it. Well, one series of hits. Come on. Almost dead. He's dead. So that was the first Guardian battle. Nothing too hard. Well, because I played the game once. Victory! And from that, we can now build a church. Which is inside the graveyard, which is weird, but anyway. Houser says, Splendid King Corbo, I, House of Bull Knight, bow to you. I cannot believe you were with blah 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 blah. Thank you, Houser. And we get. Congratulations and something else, right? We get a gold bar as a reward, which is cool. We now have. 10, 20,000. Oh, no, actually, 16, 81,000. Which is kind of plentiful in this part of the game, but more sleeping for some reason. Ow, my microphone thing just fell down. Oh, let me just pick it up. There we go. Okay, King Kurobo is still waking up again for some reason. We could have used the rest of the day to do some more things, but I guess not. What now, Hauser? Good morning. I have some important news. The legends about the Guardian were true. After they defeated it, the lands around the cemetery became free of UMA, making them happy. Oh, yeah. We... My kingdom has expanded. We're gonna see for ourselves. So let's get out of the year. The year. Yeah, let's get out of here. And check it out. There's a festival going on because we defeated a Guardian. Now, everyone's wearing a cow skull for a head. Which is kind of funny, and there's a giant cow skull over there. It's raining confetti, and... or is that, like, paper? I don't know. So here's a previously uh, out-of-bounds part of the castle. I mean, Castle Town, if you remember, there was a fence all around here, and there were UMA here, and turnip heads, and holes, and all that. So this part of the kingdom is... this part of the kingdom is now ours, so we have over here. And past here are some more things, so we can't go there yet, but as far as the cemetery goes, it's now ours, so we can do whatever we want here, and whatever we want outside of the cemetery, which is cool. Let's see what are people saying about the festival. Hut, 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 uh, camping over the river. King, at least take a break from festival days. Launch the invasion tomorrow. Hut, hut, hut. Okay, I will, Caden. Let's see what Josh says. Same thing. I guess it's because they're both soldiers. I don't know. Let's find a farmer. I think Letty's a farmer. Or Lunasa. Your kidding is farm. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, what? Where are my 20 points, you jerk? Anyway, uh, let's go to the cemetery entrance to find an interesting character. Or is he not here today? I think you have to stop the festival for him to show up. Anyway, if you want to keep going with the game and stop the festival, you have to go back to the throne. Very slowly. Anyway, get inside. 
get on the throne, and Hauser asks, Oh, my king, does that mean you want to stop the festivities? And you say yes. And another sleeping sequence. Wow, this game is lazy, lazy, lazy in the first parts of the game. But nothing too bad. Anyway, Hauser. Oh, here's a small cutscene that it kind of sets you on the wrong foot with Hauser, but it's not nothing that bad. I mean, watch it. Difficult to leave, cold on to, and in English the nine. Because you kind of get the vibe that Hauser is evil and he's just using you to get to the skull, but he's not bad. I mean, yeah, I mean that kind of gives you the like the ooh, what is what's his goal? Is it different from mine? What is such a secretive place? And it turns out that it's just a thing. And not a bad thing, but a thing. 